Hi my friend, have you ever wondered how to make the shift from mediocrity to world class? That's coming up right now. Hi my friend, I am Janik Matzner and I teach leadership, personal development and self-mastery. And in this episode, which I'm really excited about, I want to share five big ideas on how to make the shift from mediocrity to world class, whether you are a business person or a leader in an organization, this will serve you immensely. Before we start, I need two quick favors from you. First, grab a pen, grab a notepad and be ready to dive in deep, to take some awesome notes to review later. And the second thing is, subscribe to my channel so I can accompany you on your journey towards world class and hit that bell right next to the button so you get notified when my newest video drops. With that being said, let's jump right in. The first thing is serve with excellence. Let that sink in. You need to serve with excellence. You need to be of service to your customers and you need to do it at an excellent level. You need to wow them. You need to under promise and over deliver. The old saying is true. You need to under promise and over deliver. That's how you create lifelong customers. That's how you are seen as the best in the field. But how do you do this? Well, that brings us to point number two. You need to focus. When you think about a brand like Apple, they don't do many things. They have three or four main products with the iPhone as their flagship product. Or think about Tesla. They only do cars. They don't do motorbikes or boats. They do cars. So you need to focus. You need to do a few things exceptionally well rather than what everybody else does which is doing everything and everything at mediocrity because if you have 50 products of course you can't do them all well if you focus on all of them you won't do any of them well so you need to focus you need to focus on a few things that really serve your customers and then the third thing is need to create a magical customer experience. A magical customer experience. Something that leaves them in awe and wonder when they enter your store until after they bought something. So the first time they get in touch with you, you should absolutely wow them until after they purchase something. It does not end with the purchase. Build a relationship afterwards and a few ideas make buying some from, something from you easy and a great experience and also offer some bonuses they didn't expect for example or simply over deliver as we talked in point number one make it magical just wow them make, make them want to come back to you if you can do this, create a magical customer experience. And the customers will market for you. They will market for you because they love buying from you. It feels amazing. It feels awesome to do business with you. And that's how you create a legacy. Make it awesome to do business with you. Don't be like everybody else. And then the fourth thing is transformation instead of transaction. That's it. Because most businesses today are focused on transaction. They want, to, they want you to purchase here and buy this and buy that. They don't focus on the transformation that they can make in the customers' lives. We need to serve our customers. That's our goal. Not making the money, serving our customers bettering their lives, making a difference in their lives. And people feel that. If you're only about a transaction, they will buy from you once. 
but they will stop buying from you because they feel it. They simply feel that you're not about them, but about you. But you need to be from a place of service to them to better their lives. And that aligns with the fifth thing is help them grow as a person. Ultimately, what it's all about, better their lives, help them grow as a person, even if it's just a soft work for them or something like that, can help them always grow as a person, you can make a difference in their lives. And that's your ultimate goal. Because if you help someone become a better person, a better human, if you grow with them and you help them grow, they will remember. They will remember you and they want to come back. They want to have more. They want to have the transformation again because they remember you help them deal with this or get better at this. And if you're a software firm and can't imagine, for example, how you can make a difference. Just think about what your product does for your customers. Maybe you ease it up to do video and they have time to spend on themselves rather than figuring out how to do video or something like that. So you need to come from a place of service and think how can I make this magical? How can I make a difference in my customers' lives? And don't see them as customers. Make them feel something when they engage with you, even if they don't buy. Make them feel something. So I hope these five points have been really valuable to you. If so, share with three friends so we can spread this message around. Because we need more world-class businesses today. We need more excellence in this world and more humanity more humanness when we do business because that's what business is about. It's not about money, but about difference. And secondly, take a screenshot, post it on Instagram and tag me. I would love to hear and share your story. And finally, if you haven't subscribed yet, consider subscribing now and hitting the bell that right next to the button so you get notified as soon as my newest video drops. Until the next time, Live fully, live openly, and be the leader of your life.